This video is going to be what the Dialogflow Restaurant AI chatbot is looking like. So I was able to integrate this chatbot with Facebook Messenger and uh, I got it on my website as well but I added like a Facebook Messenger integration. So now this chatbot uh, can be spoken to on Facebook. So if my voice is like kind of bad, it's because it's like 11.30 and I woke up at like 6, so I got to sleep right now, but, so yeah, this is what the area chatbot looks right now, looks like right now, so if I go right here, can I see your, your menu, we got this, and then, see the lunch menu, Order. So we got the breakfast menu. So this is this is what the this is what like the website chatbot looks like. Now let's go to the Facebook chatbot and message the chatbot and get started. So as you can see, we I integrated the chatbot with Facebook, so I can ask it any questions I want. So like, do you deliver? Or I can ask questions like So this this is pretty similar to the website chatbot, but it's on Messenger. So if any customers go on a restaurant's Facebook page, they can always message the restaurant and get their get their questions answered immediately, especially their repetitive questions that they get asked. So let's say if I want to know their location, so where are you located? Okay, so the reason why location is a really big thing is because many people go through Facebook pages on their phone rather than their computer. And it's really hard to really see their location uh, on the Facebook page because the user interface on Facebook on on on, uh, on your phone is pretty pretty bad and the text is really small so having a chatbot where you can just message the restaurant and just ask a simple question and get it answered in, in, uh, instantly is a really really good factor that almost every business should have should have right now well especially an AI integration like this should be integrated and uh, it's pretty useful and it should be the future uh, almost every business should get rid of their customer experience or customer service humans and rather have AI customer customer service uh, which is really beneficial so if I want another location oh wait no I just asked that um, let's see if I want to see their beverage Cause your beverage menu. Beverage menu. There we go. We got our be beverage menu. Or let's see if yeah. So it's pretty much it for the Facebook chat. But there are more <clears throat> questions I can ask. But it's pretty. I pretty much get the point, you know. But so this is a part two on what the dial the dial CX restaurant CX chatbot looks like here, here's some of the code for this is some of like the code for uh, some custom pillow code for what some a few messages on, on Facebook may look like and here are here is the custom payload for the restaurant the website messages messages like over here if I want to see the location on my website, so we got our location right here. So this is obviously not. There's no restaurant called Bob's Grill. Like I don't own a restaurant called Bob's Grill, but you know this is just a demo. So if I go here, here you see the menu. You know, like that the order here okay so 
this is just a video I'm, I'm gonna use for myself uh, to recap on how far I've gone with the chatbot and I would like to end this video on another note that I'm planning to to make an application with with the chatbot I'm gonna make a application that can be downloaded either either on the app store or play store or your web web application like dialogflow where people can easily create their own chatbots for their business and obviously i'm gonna have to include some api integrations into that which will which may cost a bit which may cost like depending on the amount of com compute time i might use aws or or google google's gcp but i'm <clears throat> still deciding i'm gonna see which one has the best uh best value and i'm planning to start making this chap this chatbot maker on python and then i'm going to use flutter to like you know make the ui make sure that the user interface is at, at its best so anyone can easily make their own chatbot for their business so i'm going to start maybe tomorrow start coding this this application because i realized that anyone can make a chatbot like this like all i had to do was just search up a few youtube videos uh spent hours on stack stack overflow with all these different areas especially when you go to fulfillment and then when you have to code you know your when you have to code your uh your uh, API integrations like like Google's calendar API or emailing API uh, that definitely takes some time you know fixing errors you going to stack overflow um, I spent countless hours I remember spending a almost six hours stuck on what stuck on one error and I remember there was this other error that I spent over two days over the summer and I stayed awake long nights just to do this and uh, and eventually i did i was able to sell this to two restaurants and now uh we're still are we're still climbing up providing this to more but more and more restaurants and in the future we're also planning uh to sell this to online retail stores and uh healthcare providers i was able to provide this to one online retail store i'm still working with that client and uh I did make a demo for that client as well. So yeah, it's just a video from my purpose, you know, just look at the progress I made and also my goal for this year, which is to start making an app, a chatbot maker application, which would make a chatbot just like Dialogflow, but with the easier user interface and uh, uh, which can also have good API integrations. So yeah, that's it.